Alright, ladies and gentlemen, I've returned. I know, took a bit of a hiatus. For a whole day. At least for the majority of a day. <laughs> Wait, no. If you add it together between the amount of time I haven't filled in today and then the amount of time I took off for Thanksgiving yesterday that I've been gone for it doesn't fucking matter. I'm back! Now, as you can see, I've gotten to level 16 from farming snowman. And today we're going to do like two more farms of snowman. And then we're going to do like, I don't know, maybe some story shit. I don't know, something. Uh, I got an amp shield that was just a higher, like, it was a higher capacity. It's not a B shield, it's just a random ass amp shield I found. Let's see. Uh, this is the shield I used to, that I was wearing. It's a level 15 classic shield. Oh, yeah. Uh, I got a few, like, skins and stuff. Didn't get any heads, which is the interesting thing. I got the skin, I believe. Yeah, that's actually a pretty good skin. I want to wear that. I like that skin. No one has commented what they think I should be Maya yet, so... Oh well, I still have my infinity, which I still quite like. It is still pretty good. Uh, this is not a sandhawk for those who are tuning in recently. This is a let's go. I haven't done the uh, quest to get the sandhawk yet, which is, I believe, pirate DLC. But we might do that today. I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. And uh, no one normally does this quest, but. Uh, Hey, if you want to see me do that quest, because you don't know what it is, leave a comment. I read all the comments I get, despite the fact I haven't gotten any comments. But if anyone does ever decide to leave a comment, I read it. Very rare occurrence, very rare occurrence but hey, it happens. Most of the people watching these videos are my friends. By most of, I mean all of them. Hi, Xander. Oh yeah, I just realized, I've still got to make... I've still got to put a couple of the other videos into the uh, Borderlands 2 playlist. Leave the two I uploaded on the screen. Are the ones I have to put in the playlist. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to get to level 17 and see what we can get. Which is, so for 17 I believe it's two snowman kills. After this one, if I'm not 17, uh, uh, we'll do one more fun. One more, one more run of snowman, and we'll be good. We'll be high -tech skin. That is lovely. That's a slag nice. SMG. I'll take that with a smile on my face. I already have that skin. First shield. That's a pretty good assault right there, I guess. Ooh, I didn't even notice that. That's interesting. I don't think I've ever seen a TDO rocket launcher. I wonder if there are any... Actually, let me check Loot Lemon real quick. I want to know if there are, in any Borderlands game, a legendary TDO rocket launcher. Let's see here. Specifically Borderlands 2, though. And, uh, let's see here. Let's just see if there's unique ones or whatever. Manufacturer, TDR. Weapon type? Launcher. Nope, none in Borderlands 2. Oh, I think that's because I accidentally clicked Jacobs and stuff TDR. Manufacturer, 
Jacob's teeny. <laughs> There's one. It's the bunny. That's why. Right. I forgot about the bunny. Eh, that's fair, because no one really uses the bunny. I don't think anyone uses the bunny, honestly. I'm, I'm gonna be dead ass here. I don't think anyone uses the bunny. I don't know if the bunny's bad. I just never, I've never seen someone use the bunny. That's bad. That's about the extent of my information about the bunny. I don't think I've seen anyone use it. I don't know if it's bad. I don't know if it's bad. I don't know if it's bad. I don't think I've ever seen anyone use it. Also, the next Borderlands 2 video will most likely be me showing off uh, one of my characters, whether it will be my Gage or my Krieg. I have nothing to show off on my other characters, trust me. Take it from the person who owns the characters, there's nothing interesting. Pistol max ammo. Okay, uh, let me drop something from my inventory for that, because that's pretty good. Elemental relic. Ah, uh, fuck that thing. Oh. How about that? Stockpile relic. And uh, actually, yeah, we'll do this present quest for the XP so that I don't have to farm Just snowman again on camera. Now I'll give you what few shillings I've got as a reward. I want XP. Fuck your shillings. XP is what I want. I don't need money. The kind-hearted folks at the Hyperion Corporation gave us these presents. Perhaps as an apology for all those nasty things Mr. Jack did. <laughs> really gives you hope, doesn't it? Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure the person that works that is currently still the owner of Iberian is still a dickhead, because uh, I've done this quest before. I'm not spoiling it for those who haven't seen it, but I've done this quest before. I quite like my infinity. Not many people do, but I quite like it. Actually, most people inside. like the infinity. There's they nothing wrong like with the infinity. Robots. At least not in Borderlands 2, sadly. They will sing songs and dance for our entertainment. Oh yeah, Cloud Kill. I was like, wait a minute, how did my infinity be corroded? Cloud Kill is a thing. <laughs> Speaking of Cloud Kill, uh, I recently got the Cloud Kill on uh, the uh, Legendary SMG for the Nintendo 3. I got the uh, Cloud Kill on my Amara. why they wanted us dead. Gingerton is full of egg slabs, and Hyperion was never fond of anyone who followed Brick. Yep. <laughs> I'm gonna use my Alright, so let's see here. Reaper. I don't know. Should I go into a different tree or stay going in this tree? Ricochet chance. Backdraft. Your melee attacks deal additional spike damage when your shields are completed. Each rate of fire explosion damage you never have. Your shields must fill your charge between explosions. I'll take that. That's not bad. What a truly sad day. If only the robots would have befriended us. Oh, the fun times we would have had. Timmy, shut the fuck up. Annoying. If I was monetized, I wouldn't be monetized. 
Wonderful, Vault Hunter! Mercenary Day is saved! Return to me at your leisure! Huzzah! This has truly been the best mercenary day ever! Alright, so. Let's go. Shield goes down. Watch. The fuck? Do I damage myself when I shoot or something? Or is that just amp shields being amp shields? I don't know. The only amp shields I use are the B. How many. How much are. <laughs> nice. Yeah, uh, farming snowman's a pretty good way to get a bunch of XP. Or not XP, iridium. So, uh, I don't know, what level do I, have, do I have to be to do, uh, more DLC? Because I need a new Herald, and, uh, I could farm it. Listen carefully, mouth breathers of the world. This is Patricia Tannis, and I have found another vault. As you may know, the opening of the first vault five years ago triggered a chain reaction that revealed more from Pandora. Boring! You don't want to hear about that, Vault Hunter! You want to hear about loot and packs and explosions! I'm Tori, and I'm here to ask you one question and one, and one question, question only. only. Explosions? Get off this echo frequency, you protein-guzzling protein buffoon. buffoon! I'm trying to convey- That sentence had too many syllables! Apologize! Oh, apologize. As I was saying, I've discovered that this new vault is buried in the center of a large crater and will only open, and I quote, once the champion of Pandora feeds it the blood of the ultimate coward. We at the Tor Corporation sincerely believe this is this fucking is awesome. awesome! It's so awesome that we're gonna set up a tournament to find us number one badass. If you want in, come to where the vault is buried. In the badass crater of no badass too. That's not what the area is called! Badass, badass crater, crater badass, badass attitude! <sighs> Tannis, you're not gonna Mr. Torg's Campaign of Carnage. One of my favorite DLCs. Welcome to the badass crater of badass attitude, badass! badass. This, this is Mr. Mr. Torg, Brad's head you from D If you're here, that means you will win our tournament! Point. Open the vault and earn the title of number one badass. Now, before you get started, you gotta digitally sign our legal waiver. Just kidding, fuck the legal waiver! You're in Torch Land now, sucker! Just head to the arena when I play you a sick guitar solo! Don't you guys wanna bet it's level 30 that I have to be to do this? I'm going to be quite upset if that is the case. Right now, you're ranked 50th in the badass leaderboard. Wait a minute, I can just check. Oh, okay, good. Cool. my grandma? Put ahead of some guy's in jump to death? It took several hours. It took you several hours. Ball, you gotta rise in the leaderboard. Also, you need a sponsor for another fucking legal reason. Get to the arena, and we'll set you up with one. Welcome to the badass crater. Badass, do badass. Oh, that's good. I'll kill you with this. No getting away from us. You'll pay for that. Slide, because this is Borderlands 2, not 3. I'm fucking disorganized as shit! And was busy suplexing a shocker and a bow tie when I should have been setting up sponsors! You may ask yeah. who was who wearing the bow tie? You were the shark. Answer? Answer? Yes. yes. 
I believe the uh, I believe that the uh, I believe that the yes comes in from him. Where like someone will ask, uh, are you a boy or a girl? And then someone will ask, and then someone will ask, and there's some other things like uh, how many like so and so do you have? Uh yes. I wanna see you! Everyone here is trying to kill you! Door personnel included! You're welcome! I didn't want you to get bored, so I was like, fuck it! Give everybody guns! We lost half of our workforce in three days! But who gives a fuck? If I manage to get a cobra. You guys know what the cobra is, right? It's a really rare like, sniper yeah. rifle. That you can only get from a specific I think they were burners that you can get it from. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe you can only get it from burners. Blue sniper? <laughs> it's either blue or purple, one of the two. Wait a minute, I have loot lemon. What the fuck am I doing? I can, I can look this shit up. Uh, I'll be back whenever I uh, find, find that out. Also, I really do look like a knockoff Lilith from the back, don't I? Like, if you look at me from the back, I look like knockoff Lilith. Alright, uh, I'll be back when I find out what rarity the uh, Cobra is. Okay, so. The Cobra is a blue Jacob sniper rifle. Uh, that can only drop from burners. It has a 0.056% chance to drop in, in one player. It is... Your chances decrease if not all vault, if not all players wear a Vault Hunter relic, or not playing on UVHM level 73 or higher. Oh, fantastic! Because uh, the only thing that I'm doing properly here is using this. Wait, no, I'm not even using that. Okay, so, only burner enemies can drop it, and they have a very, very low chance to you, baby! <laughs> I'm impressed with how you handle yourself out there, Vault Hunter. I even need a sponsor, and as it so happens, I need a new apprentice. Come find me at the arena. Just follow the succulent scent of success. <laughs> Piston, what would you say to those who accused you of cheating, of rigging fights to gain your number one ranking? Wow, Jeffrey. Well, I guess I say I'd have to do this. And then I tell them to never call me a cheater! But you are a cheater, you cheating bitch. And you can quote me on that. Hey, over here, newbie. Here's what Piston's offering a chickadee. Piston will sponsor you. Piston will take you under his muscly wing, and we will open that vault together. I've already set up your first fight in the arena. Get in there and show him that Piston and the Vault Hunter are a force to be reckoned with. Is it just me, or does it seem like he's gonna betray the fuck out of you? And there's Piston's blood up there. Welcome to the jungle. We got fun and game. So, now usually, you're first match to be against a single opponent, but I thought, eh, instead you're gonna be fighting a few dozen chunks called the Horde of Horrors. Now, hmm, I can keep the rest of both text time behind my back, but you wanna take it easy. Ladies and gentlemen, it looks like our next combatant has arrived. Does the Vault Hunter Is it possible to get anything other than a gray shotgun from that? I think we all know the answer. Maybe! The rules are simple. Use the provided loot and kill everybody. The last fighter standing is a, a bona fide badass. badass. Go to the center of the arena when you're ready to start. I love how the arena looks here. Like, I think it's a really nice detail. 
that something interesting is the fact that, as it turns out, everything here gets cleared out at some point or another. Ladies and gentlemen, it's the moment you've all been waiting for! The Horde of Horrors versus the Vault Hunter! Fight! I didn't oh, sign up for this, damn it! Hmm, close my arms, I'm going to overcharge. You don't have a time limit on this. Wait, please! Don't get too comfortable! Vitality Relic, that's not bad. I like that, that's, that's pretty good. Next way, bitches! Oh, the hell! Okay, so I have decided to find one thing that I, uh, that I mentioned in. I can't remember what episode, but it was an episode where I said that I needed to get my gauge of all time right? So that I could get the uh, higher rate chance. Fight these idiots. You're gonna have to pick up the pace if you want to be Piston's partner. And the uh, and I've decided that I'm not taking it from mine because I want to get the funny drops on the because it is the series. This is the character that I'm going to be like playing on the series, right? It's time for another way. Something I might do though is like reset my gauge. Not like reset my gauge, but reset the EVA template here of my gauge. Because if I'm being unique here, I'm probably not going to do all the EVA jam and EVA jam shit on this. At least not for the series. I might, but I probably won't. I'm not sure if I will. I'm not sure if I won't. I do think for sure. But this Maya is going to be pretty fun. Like, I'm going to main this Maya until she. Most likely in the front. That was brutal! Where is the rat? What the fuck is a rat? I love how right there he says where's the ref and then later on when Moxie asks where the fuck is the ref, he's like, what the fuck is a ref? That vault under's two and two waves like a fat kid through a cookie store! No, I want cookies. cookies. Here's a town! It's the final one! Don't die now! Another present! Imagine if I get a cobra, that'd be fun. Forget it for fuck! Uh, I Yeah, yeah, yeah. That it was. I'm gonna use my hero. I'd almost finished my comic I'm gonna use my let's go. Wait, am I slacked? Is that it? I've seen a few enemies with flag weapons. I am not sure how exactly that was considered badass. All I did was run up to him and shoot him. Tends to be what you do in a Borderlands game, Torg. You would know, you've been in, been in every Borderlands game since this one. Including the preceding one. Which means, technically, you've been doing this bef since before this game. So... Hold on a second, I kind of want that sniper. Or do I? I'm pretty sure I have a pretty good Jacob's one. Yeah, I have a pretty good Jacob's one. So, uh, oh, I don't know. Well, you can go get your bitch The Vault Hunter wins and is now linked up to rank number five on the leaderboards! <laughs> Piston is proud of you. I've arranged for the stagehands to deliver some guns to you. Take them. <laughs> Piston thinks this will be the start of a beautiful relationship. Or 
tokens. I should probably turn off that. Oh, I'm not one. Let me see here. Options. Gameplay. No, I don't want training messages. Share the false prize with some no name mercenary. I'm the greatest fighter who ever lived. I will well, you didn't kill myself. Handsome Jack, I did, so, uh, fuck you. Well, get the hell out of my arena. That noise you're hearing is the arena filling up with harm strong gas. I've turned off the cameras. Just breathe deep and pass out like a good little cow. Damn it, I almost made it to the door, too. Something that kind of confuses me is that in the precipice, right? I know, I know, everyone's like, ooh, precipice bad. Precipice isn't bad as something wrong. I don't know why everyone hates on the precipice. There's nothing really that wrong with it, if anything at all. But something really interesting that I don't think anyone has ever talked about is that the pre-sequel will talk to your character specifically. Like, let's say I'm playing as, like, Claptrap or Wilhelm. Uh, Jack will have specific voice lines talking to that character. Let me educate you, talk. The Vault Hunter ran away. They found out they'd have to fight me. Pissed to become the number one badass on Pandora. And they ran away like a little baby. Ran away? This is a travesty! Hey y'all, welcome to New and Improved Catch a Ride. Now it's 47% more than 26 percent Uh, why did they stop talking? Okay, it's straight up dog time. I know you ain't actually a coward, but fuck that twist and it didn't make me some good TV. Still, you're gonna need a new sponsor if you want to slay your tank! Get to the beatdown! That means I can farm toward tokens. If anyone who's played the, the uh, Borderlands 2, you'll know what I mean. I'm not sure why everyone shits on the pre sequel. It's not that bad, really. Not that bad at all. It's actually pretty fucking fun. But everyone's like, oh, pre sequel bad. Why is pre sequel bad? Like, what's wrong with the pre sequel? It's not that bad. Something interesting is that the only games in this series to let you travel to other planets are Borderlands 3 and the pre -season.
I tell you, that Vault Hunter Coward was like a child to me. I spawned him, brought him away. And when he came down to the come down, he ran away with me. I'm gonna make him a mighty authority. I mean, with the whole tower thing. You're still the number five badass on the tour of the door. Pissing's number one. You just gotta kill your way Shit. up the list, and then you'll be able to whip out your heroism and slap Piston in the face with it. God damn it. There's no one around for me to kill, and I'm too slow. So I would have kept walking, and I would have died anyway. Uh, I'll be right back. I gotta do something real quick. Alright, I'm back. I've returned. I ate a bowl of cereal. And, uh. And did some other stuff. But, uh, now I'm back. And while I was eating my bowl of cereal, I looked over and realized how fucking thick Maya is. In damn is she. Fuck every part of the situation. I'm just gonna keep going this way. <laughs> it's the coward! You're gonna burn! 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 Say me, bitch! Fire in the sky! Let's talk! Fire walk with me! Fire talk with me! You kill fire a beach ass at some point! But you gotta wait until you find out where he stashed that sponsor he kidnapped! Otherwise, you can't rise up the leaderboards! Unexpected. Why exactly do I need a sponsor to rise up the leaderboards? That, that just hit me. So I'm gonna give you guys a little bit of a as the as Start some trouble here in the big town, and then I will give it to you. Get to the battle board! Go! Now! Before the flames rise! His gimmick is that he really likes fire! Enough! That was interesting! Ironic got a burner. Ironic got a burner. Burner. Hey, come on, burner. If you miss any of the night, go Oh yeah, so, since some people are probably like, So, uh, what are you watching this time? Uh, I'm watching this, uh, I was about to say smaller. He's not really that small. He's like 5.46 thousand subscribers. 5.46 thousand subscribers, this guy has. And, uh, his name is Apothos. 
Get ready to grab a beer and kick some rig, cause it's time for a beatdown bar brawl! Just pick a fight with the drunks and I'll just be like a diva. Oh. Just it's a trolling thunder. Ladies and ladies, gentlemen, how much are you doing this one again? If I were playing Gage, I could use death trap. This has to be one of my favorite things to do is to just walk on. Alright, now that I've left the Her train is doing shit. All I'm doing is holding down the trigger. All of them. All right, let's spend the skill point. Time for some training. All right, this is not training. This is me spending skill points. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> All right, so something I want to know, you guys, is uh, what is your favorite DLC? He's gonna give you a sponsor. Sponsor I kidnapped is in the bar. Go find her. This is not a trap. Um, yeah. Here we go, black fans. This viral paper is the ball hunter. Fight! This is a boss fight. I'm not going to be cocky and use my uh, enemy. Well, not necessarily the cocky, it's just uh, the I like the fact that ammo is not an issue. I'm gonna if Pyro Pete has any dedicated drops. One sec. Because uh, I might actually farm him because I can do that. Pyro. It's probably just going to show me Pyro Pete the Invincible. Uh, yep, yeah, uh, only the raid boss version has anything. Specifically, only the raid boss version in UVHM. So, uh, never mind. Nothing.
ay, ay, ay. Allegiance. Ooh, actually, that would be pretty good since I've been using my infinity so much. Uh, honestly, I don't need a plasma. I don't need a plasma caster. Uh, I don't need shotguns. Shit, assault rifle. Sniper. It's not better than my Jacob's one. Crew 69, crew 53. I'll take that. And I'll put that on because Vlad will. A lot of damage, yeah, that's for sure. And now it's Vision the Barbarian, the beautiful, the most buxom sponsor of the history of Pandora, Mad Moxie! Yeah. Miss me, sugar? Thanks for the save, though. So, you want what's in the vault? Huh? And given how tragically long it's been since I ran my own fighting ring, I went towards Coliseum for myself. I think it's time you and I became partners. With benefits. Head back hey, to yo. the main crater and we'll talk strategy. Hey, yo, pause. What's that? Hmm? You hear something about so you found another spot. That's sweet, baby. But let me explain something. You're still just a no-name merc with muscles like wet noodles. My pecs are laughing at you right now. You hear that? If I was playing Krieg, that would make no sense, because let's be honest here, Krieg would bend... Uh, Krieg would turn Pirate... Not Pirate, Krieg would turn him into a croissant. Let's be honest here. If Krieg wanted to, Let's be honest here, because he's a psycho. He does want to. He would turn Piston into a croissant. Uh, Let's see if I can get a better yeah, shield here. I can't be that way. Yeah, because I don't Where's really like this. Pizza? You're now the number four badass on Pandora! Grats, mother fucker! Also, you should treat Moxie nice! Nothing is more badass than treating a woman with respect! Be careful out there. Try not to die! I love how both Zed and, uh, with Marcus actually care for your health. But the only reason they do care is because you give them business. At least that's how it is with Marcus. I'm pretty sure Zed actually does care if not you die. I have never hit that jump in my life. That was fucking dope. Depends on the gun, because if it's an infinity, I'm holding it. Hey, darling. Right now you're ranked four. Wait a minute. What level is this? Oh, my shit is level nine. The Torg leaderboard, but don't worry. There's nothing better than getting to third. Base. It's a sex thing. The rank three badass is a cannibalistic roadhog named Motor Mama. You'll need to train a little before you take her on, but I've hired the best trainer in the business. Go meet her. Motor Mama's hiding out, just waiting for the other gladiators to kill you. Once you're done with your training, you'll be ready to lure her out. Who door tokens? Huh? <laughs> 
you guys think I should go farm new weapons? If you think I should go farm new weapons, leave the, leave the answer in the comments. Because uh, I probably should. But uh, hey, if you guys want to see me go farm new weapons, be my guess. I'll go do it if you want me to. If I'm being honest here, though, I'm going to do it all off camera. Fun in fact, this sign right here is the only thing that has been in every Borderlands game. Save for the Skull Masher, but still. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for the wild child, the queen of obscene, that girl who'll make you hurl! Butt to the arena and let's do this shit. I'm stealing this idea from either Dolts or K6, but imagine if there was a Breaking Bad reference right there, you just see Mr. White and Jesse cooking. I can't remember if it was Dolts or K6 who did it, but. Oh, yeah, those can explode in this DLC. Kind of forgot about that. One second, I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back. Also, if I'm being super quiet, it's just something I do unconsciously. So, uh, for the people that will, don't take that personally. It's just something I do. Step one of my training regiment is food. You got to get those carbs, son! The back of the arena got tons of noms for the workers. Get some cookies so you can eat them and grow up big and strong and kick Kristen in a butt butt. Don't get me wrong, sugar. I know you don't generally need the help of a trainer, but it'll go over great with the crowds. There's nothing the masters love more than a trainer sequence. Why am I doing less damage? See how I'm doing 54? This is a level... This is a low latent infinity that, that that's supposed to do 56 damage. And I'm using a Vladov Allegiance Relic, which makes me do 12 more damage. 12%. 12 percent 12 more damage. Why am I doing less when I take this off? Because look, I was doing 54 before. Oh no, I am doing more. I remember doing 60 to... What the fuck was I doing 60 damage to? Hmm. I was doing 60 damage to something. I think it was because I was shooting squishy meat. Oh snap! I got chocolate chip! As a connoisseur of tasty treats, I can assure you chocolate chip cookies are the for real deal. Chocolate 
breaking. I just want to talk to Jim Cookies! Why don't you talk to Jim Cookies? tattoos of something and I'm like yeah sure what, what, do, what do you have in mind and uh, since we're both Halo fans I grew up with PlayStation but I had a 360 so uh, Reach was one of my favorite games back then and uh, we're both Halo fans right he likes God of War I like Halo so uh, we mutually agree both of our consoles exclusives are fucking dope and so uh, he was like we should get the ODST tattoo and I was like what's that again and so he sends me a bunch of pictures of those and I'm just like yes but then he's like, what if we did what this one dude did and sent me a picture of this dude that got the ODST tattoo fucking massive on his entire back. And I was like, are you sure you want to do that? That's gonna hurt like a bitch and a half. And then he was like, yes, yes I am. Because uh, I know people who have gotten tattoos all the way across their back. And they told me it felt like getting shot. And I was like... If you think it's such a good idea. Your training is complete for now, Maho. So. Let me know if you need any more help from a master. Until then, get to a battle board. Moxie's fine ass set up some fights for you that should pull Motor Mama out of hiding. And so uh, I was like, well, I guess if you think it's a good idea. And so uh, now, whenever we turn old enough to get tattoos, uh, we're going to get. Uh, Higher fucking ODST logo for the entire battle. That's gonna hurt like a bitch. This is gonna take a fucking age. Looks like they call this one the Death Race. You've got to speed across the crater and kill a bunch of bikers along the way. If you do well, Motor Mama might lift a shirt for us. Metaphorically.
thing. My, my, I get on the thing. trying to get my attention. If you like, we can fight each other and see which of us is the best. Sound fun? I'll be waiting for you. Don't let her voice throw you. Motor Mama is a stone-cold psychopath. I don't want to get too graphic, but let's just say she eats her own children. That's fucked up on another level. Second. Let me check how long I've been filming for. And then depending on how long I've been filming, I'm going to end the episode here. Since I do try to make my episodes between like 30 and... 20 and 30 minutes. Come on, let me check, you bastard. Slow-ass PC, come on. Fucking crap. Two hours. Oh. oh, it's glitched. It says Borderlands 3. I haven't been... Hold on a second. <sighs> Ain't no fucking way I've been playing this game for two hours, bro. You are on some shit. I've been playing this for two hours, bro, I swear. That's gotta be a glitch, right? Oh, yeah, my Discord's fucked up. That's just fantastic now, isn't it? Uh, well, I think I'm gonna end the episode here. Uh... So uh, that'll be it for today. I will see you guys in the next video. Uh, this video will probably not take long to edit since I don't really edit them, as you can see if you watch the other episodes. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.